M0FX will be going to quickly add a repeater to my ICOM 7100. So the first thing we'll do is get ourselves into VFO mode. So you go to memory, uh, sorry, menu number one, see M1 there. Keep going, memory one, and then select VFO or memory. You want VFO mode, okay? The next thing we'll do is select our band. So tap the screen and select, we're going to do two meters, so 144 megahertz, or you could do 430 for 70 sems. Then we'll just dark, turn the dial to select our frequency. If you're not getting the right steps, then you just change your step. Just hold your finger on the frequency. You can change steps there. I usually choose 6.25. So now the next thing we want is our shift. Now it is it is in the memory automatically, the shift. I'm just gonna show you what that memory is. So go to set, go to function, then go to split duplex, and then go to the one you want is the duplex offset, okay? And it's already on, it's already in there by default. You can actually change this to zero. You don't have to have it, but obviously it's more handy. Or you can have an unusual offset for, for a, a certain repeater. But we know that that's set to duplex offset. So we come back out. And all we now need to do is select the duplex. So just press the menu button until you see the word duplex, which we see here on menu number two. Tap duplex and it's already put it in there and it's got the shift there for you the now. The next thing we want to do is turn on our tone. So tap tone, same menu. We've got the tone turned on. Now, if we hold our finger on the tone, we can set the tone frequency. Repeat, it says repeat a tone, and we can now change with the large dial to 94.8. Let's back out, and then we'll test it. Let's go like menu. Now, note that it does show the input frequency on the screen. You can actually set this up in split mode as well. I'll just show you how using this feature you can turn off duplex select split and it will do it and you have a similar menu if you go to function split duplex and go up you can set the shift plus and minus for the split offset you can see that we're receiving the repeater there no problem So that's it, so you've got your output, your input. If we key the mic, it, you, know, you can see that the A band, the tone is on, the, the duplex shift is on, ETC. So thanks for watching my channel, 7.3, all the best.